Hi guys and welcome to another Skyrim mod showcase where we're going to take a look at the Noldor content pack. This is another great set of armours from Matty743 and was actually in production before his Bosma armour collection. This armour is based off a fan art project for Lord of the Rings by the mod author and is their interpretation of what the armours would look like in that world and they actually fit seamlessly into Skyrim. All the armours are light armours and they're split into two tiers. Tier 1 has a lower level light armour, which can be crafted using the elven perk and is slightly higher level stats than elven armour. The second tier armours will require the glass perk to craft and have the same stats as ebony armour but they still retain the light armour category. If you're not a big fan of crafting items you can obviously add these using the console and the mod author has placed the ID codes on the mod page just to make this slightly easier for you. These armors are also available in the level lists and it depends on what level your character currently is to what armors you will find as loot items. As you can see from the scenes, the armors are all fantastically detailed and have very nice intricate patterns on them and just are very rich dark textures in game of a high quality. For this showcase I am using the Real Vision EMB um, performance version. And you can see that the textures are quite dark for some of the armors. If you do use an EMB and you do find the textures slightly too dark for your setup, there is a lighter texture version on the mod authors page which you can download and has slightly lighter textures which just look a bit better with some EMBs. But for me, I like the rich dark colors, especially on the bronze type armors. To denote which armors are from which tiers, the mod author has added royal to the start of some of the names. However, the Noldor Guard armor is exclusively a tier 1 armor, and in tier 2 you exclusively have Elrond's armor. To accompany these armors, they each have their own unique shield, which is in the same color design as the armor, and also there is a nice blue cape, which comes with a vest or without a vest, and is fitted for any of the armor types. In addition to the capes and shields, there is also a selection of weapons. There is three weapons for each tier, and these involve a bow, a greatsword, and also a single-handed sword. And these, obviously, depending on the tier, will require the same perks to craft. So for tier 1, you'll need the elven perk, and for tier 2, you'll need the glass perk. I'm a big fan of this mod author's other weapon and armor mods and I think this one is a fantastic addition to the collection and it's definitely a recommend download from me. As always if you've liked the look of this mod please do head over to the mod author's page and check it out there and obviously remember to endorse if you use. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time.